whether you're using the Gmail app right here on my iPhone, the Gmail app, or you're using Apple Mail, you have the ability to unsend an email that you wish you had not sent. Let me show you what I'm talking about in both these apps. I'm going to go to the Gmail app. Now, I have multiple Gmail accounts in this Gmail app. You can see if I click on the picture in the upper right-hand corner, I can switch from Teddy Burris at Gmail or T.L. Burris at Teddy Burris, Burris Consulting, et cetera, et cetera. But I'm going to stay in my free Gmail account and show you what I'm talking about. If I go to compose a message, I'm going to send an email to T.L. Burris at BurrisConsulting.com. Call it test. And just say, hey, dude. Now, I'm going to hit the send button up top here, the little arrow. Look at the bottom. It says sent, and it says undo. I hit undo. It brings it right back. And I can adjust it and change it however I want. And then I can hit the send button again. And there it is, sending, and I have the undo. I'm going to do it one more time. Hey, dude. What's up? Now I'm going to hit the send button again, and then I'm going to count. 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000. About, about five seconds, and then the message is gone, and I cannot recover it. And now if I go look at my sent items, you can see it's 927. At 927, I sent that message to Teddy, which is T.L. Burris at Burris Consulting. And there's no recovery here. There's no option to bring that message back. There's no option to undo the send. That message has been sent. The only option I have is to, to delete the message from my sent items. But again, I cannot bring the message back, cannot recover it from the person I sent it to. This is using the Gmail app on my iPhone. Now let's go use the Google or the Apple Mail app. So I'm in Apple Mail. I'm going to go to the same account, Teddy at Gmail. And I'm, I'm again, I'm in Apple Mail. I'm going to create a new message. I'm going to send this to T.L. Burris at Burris Consulting again. Hello, Teddy. Let's chat. Now I'm going to hit the send icon in the upper right hand corner. Look at the bottom. Send, uh, undo, send. I can click on that. Brings it right back. Let's chat today. I'm hit the send again. It still has undo, send at the bottom. One more time. Let's chat today about lunch. I'm going to hit the send again, and now I'm going to count. Remember, I'm in the Apple Mail app using my Gmail account. 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000, 6, 1,000, 7, 1,000, 8, 1,000, 9, 1,000. About nine seconds. It may have been 10. I was counting slowly. Before that message is now sent, and I do not have the ability. Let me go down here and find that email. You can see at 929, there's the message that I sent. And again, just as in the Gmail app, when I look at this message that I sent, I do not have the, any option here to recover that email. Now, I'm going to show you on the iPhone, in the Mail app, how you adjust the delay for sending messages. If I go to Settings, in Settings, I scroll down here to Apps, then I scroll down to Mail. And in the mail app, if I scroll, a little, where is it? I think it's at the bottom. There it is, sending. Undo send delay. I had the option of turning it off, setting it for 10, 20, or 30 seconds. Again, this is using the mail, the Apple Mail app on your iPhone. This is not the Gmail app. This is the Apple Mail app. So I can set it for whatever I want. Now, here's a snafu. In the in Gmail, I would expect to see a setting on Gmail to adjust the delay when I'm sending emails 
again, from the Gmail app, in this case, from the iPhone, which should also relate to the Android app. However, the setting is not here. There is no setting in the Gmail app to adjust the delay. It is five seconds by default, and there is no way. I have not found any way to adjust the setting. Furthermore, and I've tested this, if I go to Gmail on my computer in a web browser, and I adjust the setting, it does not adjust the setting for the delay send when I'm using the Gmail app or my mobile phone. It is five seconds, and it appears that there is no way to adjust the delay, again, in the Gmail app or my iPhone. Well, let me show you what I'm talking about. I'm in the same email account, teddyburris at gmail.com, but now I'm on my MacBook, I'm in Chrome, and I'm using the, the Gmail, I'm using Gmail in Chrome. Now, if I go to settings right here, see all settings, it's the third item down, undo send. By the way, I've had it at 30 seconds all along. So when I send a message from the web browser, let me make it uh, 20 seconds so it doesn't take so, so long. I got to come down here and hit save. Now when I create a message, again, I'm, on, I'm in the web browser in Gmail. I'm not on my mobile phone. And I send a message to Burris Consulting, another Gmail account, test. And I say, and I hit send. Look at the bottom. Undo, 1-1000, 2-1000, 3-1000, 4-1000, 5-1000, 6-1000, 7-1000, 8-1000, 9-1000, 10-1000, 11-1000, 12-1000, 13-1000, 14-1000, 15-1000, 16-1000, 17-1000